Doesn't sound right, eh? Mm. Yeah, she's stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't want to move, eh? We're going to come up with a new plan. We're going to get this out. Penetrator here. Wassel blocks rain. Oh, that's right. We're off to a jetter nozzle or a jetter hose stuck in a sewer drain. Tom, he's got his jetter stuck. It happens. It happens to all of us from time to time. There's nothing worse. It's a sickening feeling when that happens. All you want to do is get the thing out of the pipe um, without making, with the least amount of problems, I should say. This one stuck under a house slab by the sounds of it. Uh, not good. He's gone down a uh, toilet upstairs, down a stack. Cleared the blockage, but his hose wasn't coming back. We don't know what is causing this. We can't get it. He can't get a camera into that area to see, uh, to try and work out a plan of attack. Uh, so he called a mate of mine. A mate of mine said, give Gavin a call and see if he can help you out and get this one all knocked over and get that hose out of the pipe for you. So we'll head out there, work out a plan of attack, do some investigation work and uh, try and work out the best way to go about getting this out uh, without getting my jetter stuck, real one stuck or my real two stuck and getting all three stuck in the same blockage. We don't want that to happen. That, that won't be good. It is Saturday, Saturday lunchtime. We don't want to spend our weekend busting up someone's house, living area, concrete floor to get some jetters out. Right up. I'll see you when I get there. We're just out here with, with Tom at the moment. His jet is all set up. We're going to head back inside. Uh, he was clearing a drain yesterday and it got his nozzle stuck. So we've been out the back. There's an IO. This is a, a bit of a weird setup. Uh, we could see the nozzle and we've just given it a bit of a push with our pull back with our hands and we've got the nozzle back into the main. Um, it runs all suspended, drops down through the wall and then um, disappears under the slab. But we are up here. Nothing can be seen with the camera. This way we can't see anything. It's a pretty long run, but we are stuck. Um, we're gonna try and see. We've got, done the old dishwashing liquid. Now we're gonna fire up the jar and see if we can just release it. Doesn't sound right, eh? Mm. Yeah, she's stuck. <laughs> <laughs> do you have push connect or twist? That's twist. And do you nip them up or is it just hand tight? I just go hand tight. There's so many offsets in the zone, eh? Yeah. Doesn't want to move, eh? So we've pulled it back a bit, but we can't get it any further. Now we can go forward. Yeah. Okay.
We're gonna come up with a new plan. We're gonna get this out. We're gonna pull this tool out. See if that can get closer. This could be an access panel in here uh, to the stack point. We might even check that. Before we pull the toilet, a lot of flickering going on, like a rave from the 90s. Um, I never went to raves. <laughs> nah, we pulled one of these snap vents off before we pull this toilet. We can see the stack point right there. And there's an IO cap just up there. We need to unscrew that. That's our next mission. But Tom is going to um, just run the camera down past it, just to make sure it's not charged. Um, up to, I don't think it was from memory, but he'll run that down. We'll have a bit of a look. Okay, I've got some footies. Let's see if I can get this up in here. <laughs> got it. Um, yeah, I've got no. Okay, 40. Do you want to bring one of the cameras down? Plug. Okay, we've got all that out. It wasn't charged, which is good. Now we've got to try and flick a camera up there, see if we can see what is going on. Pulling the right hose or the wrong hose. <sighs> I think we've got it for Tom, mate. He's going to be happy. Happy days. All good, Tom. Yeah, right. Yeah, so I can explain to you something that can happen to. Yeah, please do. From what my, what I've noticed is if you go around like a ton of bends, yeah, yeah, yeah. another thing is you just lose control. That's it? Yeah, because that's so pull it's just the bends in itself. Yeah, that's what I've noticed. I've had it happen before because we went around heat. That's it? And, that? and I, I just couldn't get any kind of pull. Oh. So if you want to pull this out, mate, yeah, yeah, from upstairs. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's going to be one happy man. His client's going to be one happy client of his. So we'll feed this back out, then we're going to chuck one of Jordan's U-Tool cameras down there. And um, 
to see what's going on because we've got closer access to it all now. Should I play a practical joke on the guy and just hold the hose? <laughs> okay, all good, mate. <laughs> You're all good. <laughs> I'm a nice boy. Uh, we got crap everywhere, but we have it free, which is what he wants. <sighs> Gotta be happy with that. Tighten up this for him so we don't lose it. Did, um, did it get stuck on the way back? Yeah. Yeah, I was holding it and joking with you. Oh, oh. <laughs> I said to this. Oh my god, I was, I was about to say to you. I, I, so I said to this, I said, oh, I'll play a joke on him and I'll hold on the end of it. <laughs> Stitch you, yeah. Stitch up with you. I was about to come down and say, I'll get stressed, eh? Hey? Yeah, I'm stoked. What are you seeing there, bud? Not yet, I can't get in. There we go. Let's have a little sticky bit, eh? Okay? <laughs> I'm stressing now. <laughs> I was like, surely we've seen, we've seen the firework in the ceiling, it's not too bad. Can't see much on his camera. Looks very similar to my camera, but it's not my camera. I'm just going to run some water to try and get rid of some of those suds. The water's going past, let's see if we get off the lens. There we go. There's some bends. What's going on? Okay, I reckon that could be the junction at that front. Do you want to throw that rigid down? The that IO? At the back? At the back yeah, and yeah. see if that lines up with that. I come back in and uh, his camera died. The battery was very, very low. And you get some charge into it. So I've put down the rigid outside and if it lines up with that junction so you can see the light right there. You just want to punch it forward yeah. just a little bit, mate. Sweet. Just in front of that junction. It looks it looks like it's the one. Yeah, all good, Tom. Yeah. So that's our junction. So when we originally come in, his nozzle was around that corner. So I'll wait for him to come back and we'll pull his camera out so he can have a look at the CCTV himself on the way back. So we've just flushed the toilet, we're just checking it, make sure if that's not dripping. Last thing we want is that to drip and um, end up with water damage down here. Appears to be all good after those couple of flushes. We'll check it once. Um, we'll check it before we put the this snap vent back on too. Snap vent's back on. Um, everything should be sorted. I've got a bit of disinfectant for him, so we'll give this a quick wipe down.
Sweet. Tom's a happy man. <laughs> he should be. His client's going to be happy. There's just a billion bends in that. So he would have lost control and not been able to pull it back once it went so far. It happens. It happens with drain cleaning. I'm going to have a quick chat to him. But other than that, we're all done here. Happy flushing. Right, all. See you on the next one. All good. Imagine. Got what am I? Man. <laughs> Imagine. Have you done it? You saved the boys again. All good, mate. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs>